Hey, love. Hi guys, thank you so much for tuning back in today. My name is Naria. This is Love Naria. It is Wednesday. Well, y'all will be seeing this Wednesday. Before we start, I just want to say thank you so much for tuning back in today. If you're a returning subscriber, make sure you like, comment, and hit that post notification bell if you haven't already. If you are new here, make sure you subscribe and post notification bell, like, comment, whole nine everything what's happening is i am starting a new segment where i'm practicing my makeup so it's going to be plenty of get ready with me talk times not only talk times we're going to do story time we're going to talk about deep discussions and things of that nature but this is my first try y'all i talked to y'all through the whole thing y'all gonna see the trial and the error um i'm I can only get better. This is me practicing. So if you would like to see how I done this natural, pretty, you know, everyday look, then make sure you keep watching. So right now what we're about to do is, we better get this makeup together. Y'all about to do this with me. I have not like done full makeup and I'm not sure how long. But we're gonna give it a try. How would it turn out? Um, I'm going out tonight. So if this turns out good, really cute tonight. If not, I'm taking it off my face, doing my regular smuggler. But I have to, I have to try. Let me hurry up because I'm talking a lot. I don't even know what I'm wearing yet. Let's get to it. While I'm in the process of doing this makeup, I am going to be much, much better when it concerns me and actually doing the makeup while I'm talking. I eat practice right now okay so because this is a step that I rarely ever take what I'm going to start with is primer we're gonna see how this turns out so we're gonna be doing 10 things no one knows about me in the process of this makeup I may finish the 10 things before I actually finish my makeup but it's fine so I'm gonna start off with the Maybelline New York Master Prime by Face Studio base and I'm just gonna put this all over my face this will be my first time actually priming y'all and my acne is so bad right now honestly truly i hate it if we're being honest i hate that i'm breaking out i hate that everything that i break out with turns dark i hate it hate it hate it but here we are while i'm priming um the first thing about me out of the 10 things nobody knows about me is well y'all don't know this my siblings know i only eat meat and cheese don't kill me I very well only eat meat and cheese on my burgers like I only I don't care for condiments so a lot of my issue is that that's why I don't have anything on my my burgers like I just don't like I don't like the extra that comes with it I don't like all those flavors I know people don't really find that type of thing that interesting but I can guarantee you like y'all not many people just only eat it and me and one of my siblings we are the exact same give me one second right now the acne that i'm dealing with is like i don't know where like leave these dry patches on me y'all like and i'm messing my face a lot so that's a lot of the issue so moving on from the primer um we're gonna move on to foundation and i'm gonna start with golden toffee by milani here i'll just put pictures on the screen the next thing on my list i have 13 siblings 13 for real for real and i am the middle <laughs> in that 13 i have a sibling older than me i have a sibling younger than me and then pretty much everyone everyone else after that is younger than me um one step that i actually forgot to take just now is i'm going to conceal like all of these nasty dark spots because it's not cute so y'all and i got them everywhere dark I'm starting to think it's a part of my skin, but I hate that for me. Absolutely, positively hate that for me. Okay, so we're gonna blend this out as much as I possibly can. 
looks white, but trust the process as much as y'all can. Cause look, I'm part trust in that process too. We in the same boat, I kid you not. And then after I try to cover a majority of these dark spots, I'm going to put on more foundation. Let me down this. All right, back to the next thing on my list. I am. Did you say? And I was coming. This is my lovely brother. They can see you. <laughs> <laughs> Literally, my partner in crime. Y'all are gonna see him all the time. So get used to it. <laughs> Just covering the spots that I color corrected and trying to blend everything out as seamlessly as I can. And I would really like to try the Monet like swirl technique. Oh baby, we're not there yet. <laughs> we're not there. Give me some time. I don't know how to blend, baby I ask me. I'm to rush because my steps are waiting on me. I want to at least put on the baby. I think now looking at my face, I'm about to color correct underneath my eyes because Buki. Hideous is hideous under there. One, two underneath the eye. Not gonna do nothing too major because I'm gonna try this like bright under eye technique. And we're gonna see how that turns out. Alright y'all, the next thing I got going is the fact that I actually have an old YouTube channel. And I think nobody really knows that because I deleted it. I deleted it because baby, if y'all would have seen what I was seeing. And I have nothing to do. See this book? This is awesome. Y'all should read it. Untamed. <laughs> No way that I even did all of that. It's no way. The name of the channel was called Naria Screams with F. I should tell you exactly why I decided not to keep that channel. Oh, 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 oh. Wait, I just thought about something. I really want to use this uh, Juvia's Place concealer stick. Um, I'm not sure about what shade it is. I'm not even gonna hold y'all. I, I, I wouldn't even lie to y'all like that. But I'm trying to attempt like the like bright colors on the in and out and you know, the warm color in the middle. So we're gonna try that method and see. Okay, doodle. I'm gonna make this. People want it to be great. <laughs> It was stuck in my head. Mm -hmm. Unlock the swag, the swag, unlock. What is that? You don't remember that? I feel like Beyonce did a before. little dance to that, so I stuck in my head. Mm -hmm. yeah, I don't know. I don't know if y'all are seeing this, but I can't see when I do that. Just trust the process, y'all. I'm gonna get to the point to where I can find like a really nice spot set up because right now I'm not there yet okay another thing with me y'all is I've never contoured my face ever ever at all like I've never really needed to because I kind of have this naturally dark contour to my face but I really want to try actually because I haven't tried I want to give it a try I don't know how dark this is but it ain't gonna hurt to see Ooh, bookie. <laughs> That's dark. It looks like mud, but how this contour is about to come out. Don't judge me. I've never done this before. What is hollow outside my window? 
I know it's only like a gold. I know, like. What? Peace rolls, right? But it's the way I eat them that is so weird. You know, I don't know why. I just do. So what I do is I squeeze all of the inside of the piece of stuff out. And I squeeze it all out and pretty much scoop it like a chip. Honestly, you could ask me why I do that, and I don't know. I don't know really what I'm gonna do. I'm do this powder is. So let's go to something else. So I have this um, L'Oreal Mini Big. We gotta try a little bit. It's an eyeshadow, but show this powder may help brighten up my under eye. So far, it looks like a no makeup makeup look, and I don't want to get out of that, y'all. I don't know. I don't know. Here to contour my nose and see. So, right now, I'm trying to contour my nose. Y'all, I've never done any of this. It'll never hurt to try my. Y'all might think I'm a crazy lady because this nose is snatched. Honey, and my nose ain't this small at all. Don't lead a hype. <laughs> Look at my face so far. Cute. Really? It looks pretty decent. But I'm gonna stop here, and we're gonna pick this up another day when I've watched some more tutorials because I wanna give y'all the best one I possibly can, and when I'm not rushing, and I have to go right now, so. Why you don't just continue to get there? The question. We're gonna do that. Hey guys, I'm back and I decided I'm gonna see this through. So let's continue. Even though I feel like my biggest issue right now is the fact that my setting powder is not light enough for what I concealed, it'll still look like a no makeup makeup look. So I'm gonna just keep going. And y'all can tell me what y'all think of this. I'm gonna move on to my brows right now because I'm kind of pooped that my powder is not bright enough. So Let's get these brows on the wall. My issue with my brows is the scar in them. So it makes it pretty hard for me to shape them in a good way. And for some reason, this side is so sparse compared to this side. And this is where I need it to be sparse because this is where the brow just does what it wants to do. Let's see if we can fight this together. I'm gonna try to line this brow as best as I could. All right, let's move on to this other side. I actually never used this particular brush to sculpt my brows before, and what have I been sleeping on? <sighs> they always just be blah, like. <laughs> I don't know how I can explain it, but they just be blah, like. I can get them on, but they never like eat anymore. Like I can't make them. For my money, I cannot let, make my brows eat. Like, like what is going on? Okay, so we are about to blend out the concealer under the brow. We got one side blended. Let's get this other one together. That's the best it's gonna be. <laughs> All right, y'all, I'm going to try to conceal a little bit of my brow because it's just really, really bright right there. That looks dead on better. 
period. Okay, let's fill this brow in just a snitch. You know, I completely forgot I was supposed to be doing ten things. Oh, so another thing people really don't know about me is that I am left-handed. I'm a lefty, very special, I know. And um, as you can literally see, the brush is in my left hand. So yes, me, I'm, I'm a lefty. Um, me and one of my siblings are, I believe, me, one of my siblings, which is my oldest brother, and um, my dad, we're all lefties. But the rest of his kids, as far as I know, they are all righties. So I just find that to be cool, like, you know? Love that. They say um, lefties are artistic, which is very true. Because that I am. I am, I am. <laughs> now I'm going back in with my Golden Coffee Milani foundation and just I'm going to sculpt this brow out at the top. This is what you call stick through it to the end. <laughs> but the next thing on my list is. Um, I think I'm on number nine, and I might add a story time into this, y'all, just to keep it juicy. The next thing on my list is that I don't know if anybody knew this or paid attention to me saying this or mentioning this before, but you can turn to my channel. I literally am self-taught. I taught myself everything that I know. I figured it out. One thing I'm gonna do is make it me. <laughs> and. Give me a second, y'all, because this brow is pretty right now, and I'm not trying to mess her up. Right now, we're friends. I'm so taught everything that you see on my channel, I did myself. From the intro, to the outro, to the edits, to filming of the content, like, that's all me. My favorite part about all of this is the fact that I taught myself, I think, that gives me like a drive within myself like almost like I can do anything which I'm sure I can um because I've always had that mindset like I can do anything as long as it's taught to me nothing is impossible that's actually how I started my channel like I was just very strong in the idea that I knew like you know I knew that I could do it. Like I knew that I had these talents and as long as I try, give it a try and see. And I did that. And we are now two years and some change in and I'm not stopping or going anywhere. <laughs> so y'all don't get tired of me just yet because your girl is here to stay. They don't even look Kim right now. And I kid y'all not, they aren't that bad, but it's, I'm trying to go for a certain and it's just not giving what I'm trying to give. Like, it's driving me insane. I'm not gonna let it pump me out. They don't come from my blood with key. I'm sorry to tell you. I'm a nine. I don't even have a tenth one. That's what's crazy. The way I eat my pizza rolls is y'all have to see me to believe me for real. Like y'all would have to really watch me eat the pizza rolls so y'all can see how worth it is. I know it's weird personally. I don't really understand why I do that. And it's honestly at the point to where like it's comforting for me, like. lashes on because i'm about to take all this off and take a shower and get my bed but i am gonna put on a lippy for you guys because the lip always ties it together y'all just gotta pretend that i'm putting lashes on because i'm i love y'all though the actual lip because i'm not loving it but it's literally the first try and well, I'm trying things that I've never done before. So it's not gonna look perfect at all. But just know, oh, this is the MAC pencil and chestnut. 
just know that I am working on and doing my absolute best in trying to like wholeheartedly do this for real. Where is my lippies? It's like chocolate. It smells like chocolate for sure. And this is butterscotch. It smells like butterscotch. Maybe I should put on something on my eye. We're gonna put this Maybelline loose finishing powder in the shade 40, number 40. I'm gonna just put that on my eye. And then I don't like that I have nothing going on. on these eyes, these lids, and. And it makes a big difference. So this topic that I did want to um, address, y'all, like lately I have been feeling so like <sighs> trying to find a niche is very hard when I am like, of course, I do lifestyle content. Yes, but I still need a target audience. And when it concerns the target audience that I'm looking for, I don't know yet. Like. I seriously do not know like I don't know I know what I, I like doing I know what the certain things like everybody likes I'm gonna attempt a, a, a wing liner y'all this is what my face looks like before I miss anything else up but I really want to try like So. Mm. My first wing liner. Now, can I do this on another eye? I don't know. <laughs> but I really do want to give it a try because this one came out better than I thought. Like. My face actually looks good, y'all. To say, like, it's a subtle highlight. I just know what I was going for, and I, I, I be doing those. Be doing. You gonna try this on? Uh, wish me luck. I'm literally holding my breath. I'm literally holding my breath. Like, I'm literally holding my breath. Let's see if I can finish this one. Yo, I almost got another light hit it. <laughs> no way I held my breath like that just now, but I definitely did. Mm. That's kind of cute. Okay, y'all, that's the best I could do with eyeliner. I'm so proud of myself for even trying because there are many times over where I refuse to even try because I hated the fact that it just would not look right. What else do I want to do? Hmm. At this very moment, since I'm being like, oh, I'm risky and trying stuff, I wish I had some blush, y'all, because I've never worn blush. I've never tried blush. That's the next thing that I really, really, really would like to try. Um, I kind of want to put these lashes on now just to get the final look. Hmm. But. I'm gonna wait until next time. <laughs> the matte book, um, the crayon case. And I'm only going in here because one of my favorite YouTubers, i.e. Aaliyah, everybody's been trying the brown under eyes. So I wanna give it a shot just to see now because I'm in a good mood. <laughs> I'm doing stuff and stuff. Hmm. So let's see. I just got so much freaking makeup in my eye. I don't think that was good. Yeah, I'm really proud of myself in this liner. Like, I can't wait until I'm to the, the stage of like doing colors on my lids. And because see, I have hooded eyes. So I struggle a lot with like doing my makeup with, on my eyes because they're hooded. And I watch the techniques and everything, but everything is so much easier said than done. 
let me stop y'all because I'm, I'm i'm just doing anything at this point i don't want to get anything in my eyes i really want to put on this mascara so bad for y'all but do y'all see my pillowcases let's be smart about this it's literally what time is it it is 10 54 at night <laughs> i'm not going out anymore unfortunately but my makeup is done and i'm pretty proud like no other day would i have kept going y'all like i'm so proud of myself let's get to the lashes so um these are the lashes that i'm going to be using they're from my lash line so i'm taking this lash off the the tree and i'm going to measure it to my eye so that's what i do i measure it to my eye i'm gonna cut off bro i'm back <laughs> um i'm going to cut off the tail so if you can see the spaces between the lash, I'm gonna cut off two. So this is what it looks like now. I don't know if you can tell, but it's much shorter. I'm going to get my lash glue. Um, don't quote me on this. I'm, I'm sure it's not healthy, but y'all. Um, they say you shouldn't use hair glue, but look, this is what works for me i understand the drying time how to get it off the whole nine so that's that's what i'm using right now what i'm about to do is put the glue on and i typically try to grab the hairs so that the glue doesn't touch the hair if it's a really curly lash like this one so that's why you see me adjusted it in my hand um i'm just putting the glue on the lash line it's really really small i don't have a lot of glue at all especially because i have this wing this nice wing that i put on that i didn't know i was capable of <laughs> and i'm not trying to mess it up so we're gonna put y'all yeah, said i wasn't putting these lashes on but here i am and put on something and we're gonna put this lash on just know i love y'all y'all better know i love y'all here we go i don't know if y'all can see me or not but i'm trying to sit up as close as i can Period. She's giving baby doll cat eye. Hmm. I like her. Okay, guys, I've gotten the glue on the other lash. Thank you, Aveda. Let's see if I can get her on there as well as I got the other one. <laughs> we are done. It's a look. And it is 11 13 at night. It's been taking me a minute because I've been making sure I took my time. But yeah. Oh, she's gay. Mm -hmm. I'm so sad I'm not going out tonight. What is going on? But do y'all want to see what I have on? I have on a bodysuit. Um, I got this on tall so y'all want fashion over. <laughs> I am about to take all of this lovely makeup off. Um, thank y'all so much for watching. I appreciate you. Make sure y'all please subscribe. Comments and likes are appreciated. Um, it's going to help me get to my goal as quick as possible. And y'all will see more of me. I love y'all so much. My name is Naria. This is Love TV. And make sure you come back. Out of my face, I put that red key in my car. These hoes ain't good. Sweet and keep